Oh, hey guys, I'm coming to you from Appalachian, Ohio. This is a region between uh, Jackson, Athens, uh, and Chillicothe, Ohio, in that triangle. I'm in the Leo Petroglyphs. Uh, this is a little nature preserve out in the middle of uh, farm country, wooded country. I had to stop and uh, ask some people alongside the road where exactly this thing was. Uh, I get here and... Uh, I'll tell you the truth, it's kind of uh, disappointing to me. I haven't seen that many petroglyphs because uh, the walls of the sandstone uh, cavern are covered in uh, moss or uh, the petroglyphs are just in locations that are almost impossible to get to in the summertime. Even if I wasn't recovering from a bad knee, I don't want to hack through this. I don't have a machete, get briars, poison ivy, uh, all that up on me and I just ain't doing it. Anyway, I did find at least one good petroglyph. It's a, it's a drawing of a drawing of a apparently human face with antlers. Whether that's supposed to be a demon, whether it's a shaman, whether it's a uh, someone wearing an antlers on their head, we don't know. In fact, we have no idea exactly what purpose any of these drawings served. Um, they're petroglyphs which is a fancy uh, Greek word meaning rock drawing. Apparently put here probably about a thousand years ago by the Fort Ancient Culture, very similar to what other human tribes have put all over Earth. Many of them still survive in out-of-the-way places like this, which is just a sandstone gorge cut by a small stream. Uh, waterfalls every few feet where another gully runs into it. Uh, it's kind of shaded down here. Uh, it's, it's pleasant on what's otherwise a hot day, but I'm going to get myself back on the road. Uh, I'll holler at you later.